that's that's really it. All right, 17 damage. Can I wrangle that out of nothing? Not really. So I'm going to do what I can with this. Ah, uh, three damage. Damn it. We were close. We were close. I know you wouldn't get very far. We're trying it again. 10. And of course he gets another turn, uses a heal potion, and then gets the swords. What the hell? Like, he gets so many combos. Like, I don't have the opportunity to get those kind of combos. All right, there's something. There's a four. There's another four, but notice how I'm getting a severe lack of combos here. There's something. Jeez. And then after that, like, I'm kind of stuck here. Okay, we'll get the reds, because I need reds. They're going to be my main source of damage, I think. All right, there you go. That's something. And of course, he just gets a massive combo of things that fell off the screen. Uh, let's go for that. I still haven't hit him yet. Uh, we're getting lots of money. Not sure that's necessarily what I want, but we're, we're getting money. Hit him again. Just hit him for the first time. How about that? Eat that. Um, uh, here's good. Right there. Give me even one higher. See, it feels like a lot of damage, but he does so much more to me. He does three times the damage that I do. Granted, I have like double his health, but it doesn't feel like that in the long run. Of course, it's frozen. Hey, there's a four. Eight damage. Moving up in the world. Hit that. All right, what do we do at this point? Uh, I could heal again. Oh, no, no, no. Boom. Extra turn. I don't think the extra turns carry over, unfortunately, but we can see what we can do here. I need to do that, huh? Well, I guess that does the trick that I need to do. Of course, they just give them extra turn after extra turn. Okay, there. That was 19 damage. We're getting there. Now if I go here, I can get more in. All right, just like what? Oh, you've got to be kidding me with this. So many damn heals. All right, there's an extra turn for me. Not that it does much for me in the long run, but you know, it's free. I might as well take it. All right, we'll take this as well. Okay, we got it, finally. We can do this and we can win. Die. Die, why was he so much more difficult than everybody else? Clearly I underestimated you, I concede defeat. All right, so we've taken out one, two, three, and four. Do you count in this? No, he does not, because he's giving me the same thing that he always does. All right. You've got to count, though. Let's duel. Let's look for fours here. I see one. Game sees it, too. Now I don't see anything. And once again, like, no combos out of it. So it almost feels like it doesn't even count when it does that. Sure, we're building up our attacks and all that, but it doesn't necessarily feel like that great of a victory. there and I get an extra turn due to luck up there six more damage I need reds though 
No, screw it. We're grabbing these. We're doing damage while we can. There are some reds for me. It just feels so good up there, but I can't do anything with it. Like, it feels like it's so close to a setup. All right, Ice Bomb. What does that do? Destroys the blue gems and heals two, per, two HP per destroyed gem. And he has destroys two columns, deals three damage per frozen gem. Okay, pressing the square button brings me back. All right, extra turn, but still no combo. Yeah, it feels like I should be able to do something with all of that, but nothing yet. If I don't get a combo, it just doesn't feel right. I don't know this. I got something in there. There's one. I don't want to go that way, though. Good enough for this. Let's just grab it like that. Should be good. It's quite a bit of damage. He does... Oh, with the combo and everything. Of course, of course. Why not? Just, just do everything. Why not? And then he goes for collapse. Does 20 more damage. Do I finally get to go here? We're doing that. And of course he gets an extra turn. Followed by another extra turn. Followed by another one. Followed by an ice bomb. Finally it's my turn. Um, is there something I can do here? <sighs> Not really. Nothing good. Uh, we can do this again. I don't think I can do 28 damage, though. Uh, let's go for that. And, of course, I set him up for an extra turn. Which, of course, just pulls into this massive combo. But I think I win here. Just with that alone, I win. All right, we win, nonetheless. Does feel like the game's against me some of these times, though. How could you beat me? All right, that's number five. Take you on. We just got so many of these guys. Feels like I almost have it, but if I do that, I already have enough reds though. It just goes for that damn surge again. Of course you get an extra turn. These are really nice abilities. That's, that's really good, those abilities. That's almost cheating. Those are so good. No. All right, we're trying it again now. Those are too damn good. Ugh, not seeing anything. I guess we'll go for that. And of course he just gets massive combos and tons of extra turns. Why wouldn't he? I get nothing though. Everything that I brought in was frozen. All right, if I do that, I can get that and unlock that. It feels like I did something good, but it's not really. He didn't alchemist and it didn't do anything? Does he not get to auto? Does he not get to pick that manually? He must not. God, once again, it just feels like I have something here. All right, we'll destroy a square. There's this one over here with four. That's 18, and I got an extra turn out of it. I have enough to freeze him, but it's, n it's not really gonna do anything for me. You're just saying to move that? Okay, it doesn't do anything for me, game. Even your advice is flawed here. All right, should be able to get, yeah, there we go. 12 damage, but that doesn't give me an extra turn. Why would it give me an extra turn? Just because they're the same color and they're linked up? What does that mean? That doesn't mean anything. Uh, that's four and a sword. 
Yeah, that's 20 damage. All right. I get an extra turn now. I got a few combos as well. And we have it. Down you go. That guy was rough. Who exactly are you? All right, so I beat this guy too, right? You already beat me and you want to fight once more? No, up to you. So let's head down here, right? There's more guys for me to, to beat. And I want to get all of them. All right, what do you have? Consumes a random mana color and deals twice as much damage. Oh, fantastic. I only need one more like that. No, damn it. I told you that was overpowered. Your defeat was inevitable. Hold on. Dealt with something that was distracting me. Let's try again. Hopefully I have a clear mind now. All right, I, I see a couple things here. There's one. No, I don't see anything anymore. So at least not the one thing, I lied. Already this is not working out well. I guess let's go for that. You know, I, I tend to go for stuff at the bottom first, but it kind of wears out quickly, you know? All right, got an extra turn there. Not that that's gonna help too much right now. Because if you go for stuff at the bottom, you have more of a chance of a combo happening. But, you know, ultimately I don't have too much. Too much going for me right now. Jeez. Of course he busts out a big old combo. I don't know, it just seems like this one's a little bit more difficult than it needs to be. Of course I set him up for an extra turn. Two extra turns, as it turned out. With lots of combos, lots of extra turns. And he, of course, can go for elemental attack now. Hooray. I guess I'll go for this. Hooray, damage. I need some reds myself. Oh, why did I do that? I set him up. Well, I got some reds here. And I'm not seeing a good spot for this just yet. You know what? This is good. Three and a sword. I think, yeah, just three there will be good. There we go, we got him down quite a bit. I need more reds. He goes for elemental attack though, so maybe I need to heal first. The top row's the only one with three. Six more damage, all right. Like, uh, Dante's damage is not the best way for me to do damage in this in this mini game, so to speak. Really, at all. Let's take that. Just take the opportunity to heal, really. And down he goes. All right, that worked out a little bit better that time. I've been defeated. Impossible. All right, so there should be at least one more guy. You know, usually there's like eight. Are you prepared to duel? Yes. Let's see what we can get here. I wanna see that. Got me an extra turn out of it. There's, there's that. Uh, I guess that, it's not really doing much. Get some reds going. Of course, I set him up. All right, he's got static charge. What does he have? I should check this. Deals eight damage plus two per red. Turns blue into red. Oh, so he's got a combo going. He's got ones that work out really well together. Hey, look, a couple extra turns. But she goes straight into the lightning.
No, I need yellows. So I guess we'll go for that. We hope we hope we, he sets me up for that at some point. I still need yellows. And minus yellows. All right, go for that. Deal at least a little bit of damage in there. Static charge. Could be really good if I could get some yellows going. I also need greens, but... Whatever. Oh, I missed it! I saw it afterwards. All right, that's... That's gonna work out well for me if I can land a good spot here. All right, four and two swords. But of course it goes straight into that. 86? He did 86 damage? I knew you wouldn't get very far, seriously? That's insane. I saw that one. Outside of that, I'm not seeing much. I'm not doing that. Of course he gets this massive combo. Uh, we need yellows. Do we have a good spot? You know what? That could do it. That could be a good one. Of course, it sets him up for for another one. Technically, I did, but still. There was another one that dropped. No, that's a setup. No, that's a setup. You get this. I, that's what I get. Damn it, that sets him up too. There was like nothing I could do without setting him up. Into lightning. All right, it consumes all his reds, so I want to get as many reds as I can. Problem is, he gets like free reign over reds. Sure, I'll. T no, why did I do that? It's a like it's a double setup there. Jeez. They told me to do it too. The game's against me. I should know better than to trust the game when it comes to what I should be doing. When the game gives me advice on how to beat the game, I should not listen. Well, that didn't do much for you, but it set me up. Take that. And that's all I get out of it. All right, we'll do that. Static charge. Okay. Feels like there's a setup around here somewhere, but I don't see it. No, I'm staring right at it. That's why. Do that. Excuse me, at least a couple combos there. Okay, that's not too bad. Wait, how much? She's got 14. So if I go here. Does that do it? Not quite. Not quite, but I get a heal out of it, so feel happy about it. And then that should do the trick for me. All right, we win. None of these are all that easy. It does require a bit of luck on my end. Clearly, I underestimated you. I concede defeat. All right, is there anybody else that wants to duel around here? That might be it. Last time it was eight out of six. Right, he doesn't say anything more. He doesn't say anything more. So we're at eight out of six. No, this guy could want a duel. Yes, all right, so we'll get nine. Nine out of six. That feels relatively good. Uh, we'll see what we can do with this. Of course, he just gets massive combos. Okay, what does he have? Freezes six gems on the board, destroy frozen gems, and deals two damage per destroyed gems. Like all his stuff, work, like all their stuff works together constantly. And you're just like, here, you take care of it now. <laughs> Figured he would still get a turn, but I was wrong. Uh, I don't know what to do now. I guess, I guess over here. Yeah, there's no moves. So yeah, he gets an extra turn. Although resetting the board did 
get rid of a lot of the frozen stuff, didn't it? I'll do that, then I'll get rid of that. Yeah, okay, fine. It's just kind of small stuff right now. It's hard to get a big combo off. Hooray, sudden damage. All right, here comes Blizzard. He's just handing it off to me after that, so it's not too bad for me. Still a little weird, though. Right, that will help. This will help. Ten more damage there. Yeah, let's go for that, I guess. So, three and two? Looks good to me. Honestly, don't care too much if I set him up. This guy's not too difficult so far. Just trying to get the heal in. Okay, deal with that. That is so much frozen stuff on the board. Uh, we'll just deal with that that way. You know, one more of those and I'm good. Hey, I'm good. And I win. If I can just spam Biba, then it works out well. How could you beat me? What I just did it was actually quite easy. So I think that's the last of them. I think that's nine out of six, right? I think that's that's the last of them, but I don't know. I think we're ready to move on. Let me double check with this guy. Maybe there's a tenth. No. All right, so then we'll head in and try to take on the boss, I guess. Unless I have to go through him first. All right, there was the treasure chest up there. No, guys, though. What? You actually beat all those warriors? In the name of the Great Turtle, you can challenge our boss. Can I beat you? No, he doesn't have anything to say. All right, let's head it and take on a snowman. Why is there a snowman? Not a soul. Do you think it could be a trap? No, at least I don't think so. In spite of their slightly crude ways, the Vikings do seem to have a fairly strong sense of honor. I can't imagine they would set a trap for us. I think you're right, Daisy. From what I gathered, they have to fight with bravery and valor to get eternal life. I don't think they mentioned Valhalla. I'm afraid of what'll happen to the marauders if the Viking if the Vikings complete their tunnel and launch an attack on the Empire. Did it say Marauders? It probably didn't. I probably read it wrong. I would say there is little to fear in that regard. Oh? Why do you say that? Think about it, Peach. Nowhere in the history books are the Vikings ever mentioned, which would suggest they never made it to the continent. Ah, yes, I hadn't thought of that. But then whatever happened to them? I have a theory. Of course, I don't have the proof to substantiate it, so I'd need to locate the relevant documents and relics. But if I am right, something triggered a sudden melting of the frozen continent. Is it us? And what prompted this, asser this assertion, Miss Daisy? I never told you how I retrieved my book. The one that allows me to use my ice power? Ah, uh, yes. I admit it has piqued my curiosity. Never have I seen its like. It's super useful anyway. I'd love to get one for myself. It's called the Book of Boreas. One of the three legendary Magi artifacts, along with the Stone of Time and the Magi Key. I stumbled upon it in the Great Library of Genova while researching the Magi. I managed to translate part of it, which is why I can use some of its power, but there must be so much more to it. The, Anarch the Anarchivist Largo brought the book to the library after his southern expedition during the Great War. His account seems consistent. He must have found it in the land of the Vikings. So if I'm getting this right, your book leaving this place causes the ice to melt? That's one possibility. The melting of the frozen continent is a long process, 
but if it were to happen over several centuries, it could lead to rising sea levels. And the world would be covered almost entirely in water, with only a few islands remaining. This would do little to change my people's future. By then all demons will be gone. 